there is a big uh, development and updates regarding express entry and you must need to know ahead of july 2022 about the express entry and entry into the express entry pool and the benefits of entering into the express entry pool before july 2022 because in early july 2022 the federal express entry programs draws will be resumed so guys you will start getting invitations from early july 2022 and also you have to find out like uh, what will be the benefit if you enter the express entry pool before July 2022 when the all program draws will be resumed in this summer this is Khalil if you haven't subscribed my channel yet please do subscribe it hit the bell icon button to get new videos notification on time stay with me till the end of this video it's going to be informative for those who are still planning and thinking that they should enter express entry pool or not yet the express entry draws for federal skill worker program and Canadian experience class programs will sooner be resumed in early July 2022 you know that guys and this announcement was made by Canadian Immigration Minister Sean Fraser on April 2022. And it's a very positive news for those who has applied for Express Entry programs and is still waiting for their draws results. So now no more waiting time guys. Just wait early July this summer. Because of the pandemic for the last two years, Federal Skill Worker Program and Federal Skill Trade Programs and Kenya Experience Class Programs draws were being pulled okay, for two years almost. So now it's going to be released. You know, through the Federal Skill Worker Program, thousands of people each year they used to come to Canada as a skill worker and they got chances to successfully establish their career and, and calls to boom the labor market in this country. As you know that since December 2020, in order to reduce the applications that were piling up in processing centers, Canada then introduced a pause in invitation rounds under the programs. Months later, Canadian Experience Class also got the same problem, you know, since September 2021, you know, when their draws were paused and invitations were stopped and that also faced the same fate and has now not seen a draw since September 2021. And especially now the situation is that the Canadian government is facing lowest unemployment rate and the highest number of job vacancies on record and an aging population and a low birth rate. The importance, the importance of reopening the country to qualified skilled workers has now become an ever more pressing goal for the Canadian government because the economy now is growing so the employers needs more foreign workers and they want to hire new workers and in this way Canada is looking for more options so they can hire new workers and those who have skills and meet the labor shortages in this country that will cause and that will become a fuel for the Canadian economic growth and that is said by the Canadian Immigration Minister Sean Fraser and that's why by July the Express Entry is poised to once again become Canada's primary means of attracting international talent. In fact, the Canadian government gradually increasing its annual express entry admissions to more than 110,000 immigrants in 2024. So now I will discuss here why you should enter and submit and enter the express entry pool before July. There are several reasons to submit your express entry profiles before July guys. I will just discuss each one so that you can understand what's the benefit of submitting your express entry profile before July 2022 because the all programs draws will going to be released from early July this summer guys. So in this way you, you can be in the position to receive an invitation to apply by early July and you know that preparing and submitting your profile into the express entry will take some time. The sooner you start preparing and submitting your profile and gather your documents the sooner you can enter the express entry pool. For example, you may need information related to your traveling documents, language test, educational credential assessments, reports, etc, etc. So these documents will take some time, okay? In one night, you cannot produce all these documents, okay? So you need time. Better you should prepare for these documents because information related to these documents will be required to enter into your express entry profile. So in this way, if you start working on this paper, your paperwork will be in order. By starting the process now, you are more likely to have 
your paperwork in order by July and be in positions to receive an invitation to apply for permanent residence when draws will be resumed in July. And the second advantage of submitting your express entry profile before July is you can take advantage of the tie breaking rules. Under the express entry comprehensive ranking system, candidates from around the world who are seeking to immigrate to Canada are awarded points for a range of human capital factors such as age, education, language and others. If there is a tie in points between candidates, then IRCC will use the time and date of entry into the pool as a tie breaker. Hence, the earlier you enter the pool, the more likely you are to be invited to apply in a draw. So this is the benefit. If you enter express entry pool before July 2022, then the government will use tie breaking rules. Okay. And that is IRCC uses the time and the date of entry into the poll that is called tie breaking rules and you also get a benefit of leveraging the benefits of the PNP. Provincial nominee program is one of the Canada's most primary immigration pathway and this program is designed both to encourage the immigration of skilled workers and to facilitate settlement in the, in the provinces across the country. In fact, all Canadian provinces have, have their own selection criteria and process. Many provinces have aligned their immigration programs with the express entry. However, since the introduction of the express entry system, many provinces and territories have created pathways aligned with the federal skill system as a way to expedite immigration process. Whenever you submit your profile in the express entry pool and select a province of your choice, you will have a double benefit in this way. You can receive a direct express entry invitation and also be selected by the province of your choice. If you receive a provincial nomination from your chosen province, you will get 600 additional points towards your CR score. And in this way, increase your, your CR score will jump to the higher level and the chances of getting your invitation to apply in the next subsequent draw will be very brighter. How Express Entity System works. This system has been introduced in 2015, guys. Express NT is the application management system for Canada's three most popular immigration programs, the Canadian Experience Class Program, Federal Skill Worker Program, and the Federal Skill Trade Programs, guys. Those candidates who are eligible for one of these programs, they can create a profile on IRCC's website, where they will be awarded comprehensive ranking systems or CRS score on the basis of their human capital factors, age, education, language, and etc, etc. And then the top scoring candidates invitation to apply in draws held approximately every two weeks and after that they can apply for permanent residency. Once your application for permanent residency approved then IRCC will issue you a confirmation of permanent residence. So guys I have explained all these things you know if you found this video informative and helpful then give a big thumb to this video. Please take care of yourself and this channel as well. Have a wonderful day and take care.